Hi Aries, I am here to do your February reading. So, um, the song I got for you guys on Shuffle was On Purpose featuring Pitbull by Dougie F. So, left the club and uh, I did that shit on purpose. I ain't been to the phone last night, I did that shit on purpose. So, are you guys playing games with somebody right now? Somebody playing games with you? I don't know. I don't know. You guys have to go listen to that song because it's a lot about, like, um, this guy's, like, doing stuff on purpose. Like, he knows what he's doing. So, like, if you're involved with somebody that you're like, oh, my gosh, this person posted here or they posted there, they're out doing this, like, they're doing it on purpose. I, they're doing it. They're doing that shit on purpose. I don't know. That's the message that I'm getting. Let's look at the overall energy of the connection between you and another person, Aries. Three of Wands waiting, waiting, waiting for something to come in. What are you guys waiting to come in, Aries, for the month of February? SOS. Um, gosh, you guys have been in an energy of a Three of Swords energy, being really disappointed. Um, you could be waiting for somebody to choose you. Like there might be some third party situations going on and you're waiting for this person to leave this other person and come, come towards you or somebody's doing this towards you. And I feel like now I can kind of see where the song fits in because you might be, um, what's the term? Like I like to call it thirst trapping. You might be like, posting stuff you might be posting things to get a reaction or to make somebody jealous um doing a lot of stuff on purpose so i feel like it's because you guys are waiting for waiting for something or just trying to show that like even if this person didn't choose you or something that you're you're still doing fine but let's look at the double energies oh there's the three of cups so and the tower. Yikes! <laughs> so we got the freaking tower. What is happening here? What is up with this three of cups? Oh, yikes. Judgment. All right. Somebody, somebody made a decision in regards to this connection. Somebody might have like walked away and when this person walked away, um, if you think they weren't affected, they were because um, it sent them into this like eight of swords energy where they're kind of like confused, don't know what to do. Like I think this person, I think if you're this top energy, you were in like a th three of, you were, you kind of had to make the decision to walk away from this situation. Um, and I think you are kind of waiting for this person to move forward. And this person is in a delay because they're a little confused. I don't know if you guys were in actual third party situations, but this person could have been out dating and you wanted something serious. You wanted them to pick you. So you finally were like, kind of gave the ultimatum and were like, look, if you're not trying to be committed to me, be serious with me, then I've got to move on. And I think when that happened, this did kind of do a bit, this did impact this person a lot. And they are, they've spent a lot of time in this eight of swords energy trying to figure out what to do. And I think you're kind of waiting for that to be figured out. Let me just let you know, though, the more that you... If you are the type of person who's like posting stuff to try and make them jealous, that's not helping. That's not helping them in the indecision because then they feel like you're already moved on. You never really cared about them. Just saying. It's going to resonate for whoever it resonates for. Um, yeah, because they're feeling like you have tons of options. They're watching you. They watch it all. If you're wondering, like this might be for like some specific people. They watch it all, Aries. They're watching it all. That's why they feel like this indecision because it's like, oh, well, they moved on just fine from me. They moved on. They're doing fine. Um, they don't need me. And I feel like if you're waiting for this person to come in, 
that's why they're not because they are and if you're not waiting for them to come in and you just want them to like eat their heart out they kind of are too they're very focused on you um but that's what's delaying them to come in they see you as like this nine of cups energy right now which is like you are just out there living your life and you are just having a ball and they're like it's delaying them coming in because they're like man their life is so much better without me why would i go ruin that for them by coming back in um when in the reality i feel like you guys are trying to work yourself out of that four of cups energy like i think if you are or Remember, this could be vice versa. So if you're dealing with somebody that walked away from you and they're posting and they're doing all this stuff and you're really focused on them, um, they're not really. They're trying to work themselves out of this Four of Cups energy, but they're very much like doing it all for show, doing it on purpose. Um, yeah, so there's like a lot of, there's a lot of trickery going on here. There's a lot of tricking energy when this person in reality they aren't the Nine of Cups, they're the Four of Cups. So, and they're really trying to get out of that Four of Cups because they were upset that they had to walk away. And they're waiting for, they're waiting for this to come in. So they're stuck in this, here's another Four. So they're stuck in like their heads, very stuck in their heads, this person. And this person's not talking. This bottom energy is not talking they're trying to they're trying to trust their intuition they're trying to like see what's going on because and this could be you because they're looking at this person and it's like they it's not that they don't want to move towards you it's just that like wow I really read that wrong because now they're out living this like great life super happy without me like were they even really happy with me so like I said this is going to be for specific people Aries but the blockage to this connection is the devil in reverse. So we've got Capricorn energy here. We've got like Scorpio. We've got we've got all the signs here. Some water energy. My Aries. Yeah, this person, uh, the blockage is that there's a lot of toxicity happening in this connection right now because there's a lot of deceit. There's a lot of um, trying to one-up, trying to one-up somebody. Um, so that's the energy that I'm feeling is in the blockage of this connection. But like I said, if you're the one watching this person like live their best life, they ain't. They're, they're doing it on purpose. Um, but if you're the one living your best life, waiting for this person to come in, that's why they're not coming in. So... Aries, I am going to be doing an extended reading where I do messages from this person, actions this person wants to take, and what your advice is moving forward from your guides. So um, I'm going to try and do both sides just in case, you know, there's two. There, you're one of the two energies. So I will see you guys over there. Bye.